A California has set a goal of having 5 million electric vehicles on the road in the next six years. And now training is underway to make sure there's enough people with the high-tech skills to maintain them. Your reporter Brady Halbleib is live in Sacramento getting a look at new EV classroom. And Brady, yeah, it's definitely a big need if they're going to have all those EVs on the road. Yeah, that's right, guys. You know, when it comes to these EV charging stations, they're often considered to be the weak link when it comes to moving towards this electrical highway. And that's why there are dozens of people wanting to learn to repair them. This is the plug. It's a first of its kind classroom in Sacramento, teaching students electric vehicle technology. We are at the beginning of this electrification revolution. And so we have to build the workforce. We have to train people. Yvette Ellis is the co-founder of Charger Help, a company that repairs and maintains EV charging stations across the country. And now they're opening up a new training program here in Sacramento at the California Mobility Center. They have assignments where they may need to break something down and put it back together again. The the number of electric vehicles in California is skyrocketing. One in every four cars in California that is sold is an electric vehicle. Ten years ago, there were just 123,000 zero emission vehicles in the state. Today, there's more than 1.8 million, but there's only 105,000 charging stations for all those cars. And it's estimated that more than 20% are broken at any given time. The horror stories are when people try to go charge their vehicles and they plug in and nothing happens. It could be the, the screen is broken, the credit card reader is broken, the cord has been stripped, but most of the time it's a software issue. This training program lasts three weeks and is free for the 15 students in each class, all of which who are then certified by the Society of Automotive Engineers. There's going to be huge demand for them once they uh, graduate with this class. Governor Newsom has banned the sales of all new gas-powered cars by 2035, and staff here say that will make the future demand for EV techs rise even more. No matter what your belief system is, I think the writing is on the wall that we are well into moving towards electrification. And all current classes are full and even there's a waiting list at this point as well and funding for the training comes from a federal grant, guys.